Hey there, terrific teachers and techies out there. Today I want to talk a little bit about a small, but maybe subtle change that happened in your Google Drive recently. And this is this button up here that says Add Shortcut to Drive. Before you might recall, it would have said Add to Drive. So this is where somebody may have shared a file with you and you click there and you could add it to your drive. Uh, so now this is something a little different, which is called Add a Shortcut to Drive. So I'm going to show you a little example of what that looks like here. So if I go into my drive and let's say I have, well, I do have a bunch of folders here, and files. Uh, if I wanted to pick a file that I have here, so let's say, for example, here, this one here called online PD opportunities. So this was in my drive. So, you know, you can right click on it and you could move it uh, to a specific file or folder, I should say, uh, within your drive. Uh, but once it was sort of moved there, it remained in that folder. So what add a shortcut to drive will do is it'll kind of give you shortcuts. So links, I guess, in a way. I don't know how you can really describe it. And you could have it in multiple folders. So right now, this is just in my drive. So if I want to add a shortcut to drive, I can click on that. And then just like you would do, uh, move something to your drive uh, into a f uh, folder in your drive, you would see here it says add shortcut. So I can go searching into my drive. And let's just say I'm going to put it in this folder here once it loads up called HRCE. There we go. And I'm just going to hit add shortcut. Okay. So that file is still in my drive, uh, my main drive as is showing there. But if I go into my HRCE, folder where I just did that uh, create a shortcut you can see so now that it's in this HRCE folder you'll notice that it has a little bit different symbol here on that uh, because this is the shortcut to that original file which is in my main drive and now if I right click on this I do get a few different options here so you notice these main options are sort of what always appeared in a file that you had where you can share it out or get a shareable link, um, do different things like that. But now down here, I have the options for just this shortcut. So now this shortcut, I could actually rename it and I could give it a different name in this file, in this folder, I should say, but the file in my main drive would still have the original name or I can make a copy of it. So. This part here just lets you sort of tinker around with the options on that shortcut while the original would remain the same. So just some little bit differences there from adding to your drive or adding a shortcut to your drive. And hopefully these highlighted them for you. So if you like this video, please uh, give me a like and you can follow me and subscribe on YouTube.